All right, you're watching DefenseReview.com. I am back with Mark Basiak from PNW Arms, and we're going to talk about this round, which is the Super Sniper round. This right? is the Super Sniper ammunition okay. from DSG. Okay. It's probably made here in Idaho, United States of America. Very compliant. 100% very compliant and ready to ship domestically as well as internationally. These are two variants that we have for this round. Now, the first one is a solid copper variant. Um, unlike typical 7.62x51 or 308 ammunition, it has a property of what we call going supersonic. Accuracy is normally obtained in a supersonic threshold. Once you go from supersonic, you go transonic, which means you'll start to tumble, and then subsonic, which means that where the round may land is variable. You can't get the precision. A standard 7.62x51 can go about 850 meters supersonic. The variant that you're seeing here goes over 1,000 meters supersonic with positive effects on target. It also is really stable in the air and has a limited crosswind component, which means that it's less affected by crosswinds. Right. Now we look at the other side. Excuse my reach here. That's all right. This right here is the tungsten version. This one will go 1,130 plus meters supersonic and have AP qualities. Very interesting. It stands for uh, armor piercing. So if you're looking for a high precision, long range munition in your standard 7.62x51 gun, there's no modification needed. It'll right. feed in any standard AR-10 or 308-7651 platform. Is there any pressure difference with this round? Standard or? pressures. Standard pressures. So this kind of bridges the gap a little bit, maybe with 300 wind mag? Well, if you bit? actually look at the operational envelope, we actually extend past 300 wind mag. So really? this is actually, uh, yeah, because remember, we're not talking yards, we're talking meters. Right. Which is a huge difference. So typically with the, what we've seen classically happen is you go from 308 to 300 wind mag to 338 Lapua. Right. Now with this new technology, instead of you know reaching out to you know a max of a thousand yards, now you have the capability to reach out 1350 like plus yards. <laughs> hmm. So 13... So 1350 plus or 1300 plus? It's, it really depends. We actually are coming up with spicier rounds so they can go a little bit further. But okay. let's just say 1300 plus yards okay. as a safety. Very cool. And this is now, is all of this ammunition, both this uh, SSA round and the uh, MEA round, are they both being currently produced or are they gearing up for production? Uh, they're they're uh, currently in production right now. So the, the DCS and the GPS, which are the MEA rounds, right. they can actually be purchased today if you put in the orders. As far as the Super Sniper ammunition, the, the first runs are going up right now, uh, but they're going to be not available for consumption for probably about another four to six weeks. But they're they're getting ready to start hitting right off the presses. Very cool. Right All right. Line. So thank you very much. PNW Arms and DSG uh, Fused Project. You are watching DefenseReview.com. Thank you, Mark. Thank you, David.